Um, testing one, two, three. I'm gonna check. Hello, everybody. This is Super Roboto. Today, we're gonna learn about Zacky Elf. Now, Zacky Elf is pretty easy, dude. It, it, it takes no effort. You just gotta focus on one thing, and that's called canceling. That, that's it. That's all you gotta do is canceling. Right now, I'm just gonna check on YouTube and see if, if I can actually hear myself. If not, then yikes, we gotta restart this over. Let's see. Yada yada yada. If not, then yikes, we gotta restart this over. Okay, I can hear myself. Ugh. Okay, so for now, we're just gonna get started for Zach Yale's jabs and everything else. Uh, okay, so Light Punch is pretty good. <laughs> You can actually do like three hits afterwards, like one, two, three. Let's see. That's weird. See, yeah, there it is. You could you could probably do like three hits, and then do a low kick afterwards. And it depends on the distance. But anyways, anyways. So the reason, um, the the light punch is pretty good. Whenever you're trying to anti-air some opponents, let's see, let's put on jumping, right? Jump four. That's weird. There it is. I don't know why. That is weird. What's going on? Oh, so I'm able to, to anti-air a crossover, but... Huh. Oh well. Yeah, but light punch is a good anti-air, but it the the it's pretty awkward, man. It's pretty awkward, especially when you're trying to like jab the opponent. You, I think you gotta jab them early or something, or probably you gotta like hit their legs like at the right moment. Oh well. Anyway, so that's light punch. But use use light punch for pressuring your opponent. That's it. Um, let's see what's next. Next, we're gonna focus on downlight punch. Now, downlight punch is pretty good. So, so downlight punch, you can actually jab the opponent. But, but keep this in mind. You buy, you guys will probably be confused. So, I, I'm trying to boat cancel right to a special move like this one right here. I, it requires both cancel, but during block mode, let's see, I'm block like this guy's blocking now, right? I'm able to both cancel for some reason, and you can do some pressure into your opponent. Keep that in mind. So if the opponent is blocking, you're able to cancel your special cancel without wasting any bold meter, but. On hit, it requires both cancel. Kind of weird, right? Anyways, um, that's pretty much the light punch. Um, you could pretty much anti-air with this. It depends on the character. And you could pretty much special cancel to this if the opponent is blocking. Now, next we're going to focus on heavy punch. Now, heavy punch, you could, you could special cancel on the first hit. The second hit, you can't. Let me see. It requires boat cancel. Um, on hit, you can actually convert it from a forward heavy punch or a back heavy punch. Like that. But during on a block mode, let's say if the opponent is blocking, right? Whoops. You can't you can't convert that to a two hits from forward heavy punch or back heavy punch. Notice how it's really slow. Yeah, so it only works on hit. However, on the while you're blocking, the first hit you can still, you know, special cast to pressure your opponent. And if you manage to hit your opponent with the light punch, you can actually convert this. So, you know, keep that in mind. Not yet. All right, next is going to be down heavy punch. Now, down heavy punch is pretty good. If the opponent is jumping for whatever reason, 
You have to get them at a different angle. You can't, you can't like hit them if the uh, the opponent neutral jump. Let's say, come on. Let's test this baby out real quick. Like right here. That's a that's a good angle you could get it from. And you go, you can, you can, spe you go jump at your opponent like that too. Let's see. Ah, oh, it's pretty Not tricky. Yet. You know, something like that. And the cool thing is, if the opponent is blocking, you can still, you can still pressure your opponent like that. So, like, yeah. No, no bold meter wasted and all that. All right, next we're gonna focus on light kick. Light kick is good. That's all you gotta know. Light kick can special cancel to pretty much anything you want. Neutral light kick, and then same thing with the down light kick. So, yeah, have fun. Just basically use this if you don't want to use the this one here. Next, we're gonna focus on heavy heavy kick. Uh, you see what I just did there? Like light like, like kick is important. Use it. Just have fun with it. Now, neutral heavy kick is pretty good. You can also special cancel on block. Same thing with the on the hits. And you pretty much know what down heavy punch, heavy kick does, right? Which is a knockdown. For this one, it goes to the projectile. Some projectiles, not the lower ones, but some. And it trips your opponent. Alright. So you pretty much know all the... You know, the attacks. The normal attacks. Now let's focus on the running attacks. Now you notice how I've been pretty much doing this. This is a running attack, by the way. We're gonna get to the special moves later on. So this is running light punch. Running heavy punch. Um... Running like kick. That one, that one is the only one that doesn't have a launcher move. I'll, I'll explain why. Let me see if I could do this properly. Let's see. That one does not have a launcher, but the other attacks do have. Is is a juggle. What I'm trying to say is this this running attack is a uh, is a reset. Anyways, let's get to the running. Yeah, that's that's how you gotta know. Um and then running heavy kick is a low attack, so keep that in mind. And it's also a juggle. I don't know why. I don't know why all I don't know why all the running attacks are juggles, but I like it. It's a good reason, and it and it goes well with the combo, except running light kick. And, and I think all of them requires bold cancel. However, some attacks does you could ex cancel without free charge, like this one. You know, something like that. And then same thing with this one. Which, which gets you in the awkward position. So you gotta you gotta play smart on this one. Anyways, that's pretty much the running attack. Now let's focus on. I guess we can focus on command moves, command lists. Holy cow! She has a lot. All right, so. Four light punch is an overhead, so if the opponent blocking down, uh, crouch down, yeah, you could just bam, like stop, 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 stop ducking, you know. And it's a good knockdown too. And you could probably hit the opponent while you're in the air. All right, next one. Um. Okay, so remember I tell you about the four heavy punch and back heavy punch? This one? Now, these two moves are actually broken. Four heavy punch and then back heavy punch. Those are the two moves that you could special cancel to super and EX cancel. Which we get to that even more in depth. 
Oh, and and these are the only moves that that you can bless mode. You, you, you get the idea. Just try to experience some combos with it. Alright, next command move. Oh, so while you're jumping and you press down heavy, you get this move. You could get it really early too. If you jump early, like if you jump, then quickly press down heavy punch. You could do it like that. Or you could neutral do it. Or back jump. Oh, you can't back jump? Okay, you can't back jump. Neutral jump or forward jump. You could get the opponent on the air. On the ground. It's pretty tricky though. You gotta be real quick with it. With it. Now usually with the arcade, I could just like, bam. Like, just do it and snap. And last but not least is down four heavy kick. Now that one's also an overhead. Let's actually let's find out. Oh yeah, it's an overhead. And this one can also be EX cancel. So if the opponent is blocking, like block the overhead too. You're gonna have so much fun. Now I know what you guys are thinking. Why is it good to EX cancel? Don't worry. Be patient, brothers. Actually, you could go skip the video because this video is going to be uploaded later on. So you don't have to worry much about it. Um, okay. Now let's focus on the jump attacks. So this is neutral. Neutral light punch. I recommend doing it when, if the opponents try to jump in. Just do that. Now this is back. Uh, this is back jump or forward jump. Light punch. Notice how it's different compared to the neutral. That's the move I don't recommend using. But if you want to use it, go ahead. This is jump heavy punch. It's the same thing on forward jump and back jump. It does a lot of stun. You know, have fun with that. Um, next is uh, light kick. So neutral light kick, I have no idea what am I supposed to do. I'm guessing... Let's find this out. Let's find out real quick. Nope. I recommend not using it because even, even I'm having a hard time for what purpose is, is used for. Just don't use neutral light kick. Back light kick is alright. I mean forward light kick is alright. Yeah, I, I think I think it was supposed to be used for some type of bold. I mean, during bless mode, but I think they kind of messed up. And then last but not least, neutral heavy kick and back heavy kick and four heavy kick. So neutral heavy kick, you can actually hold it. You can charge it up. Send the opponent launching. You know, you could do some crazy moves or something like that. And then back heavy kick, back jump heavy kick or forward heavy kick, you know, does a lot of stun. Let's find this. Like, you know, bam, 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 bam. And I miss input. But yeah, you get the idea. Now we got the jumps out of the way, let's focus on special moves, which is finally. Now, the special moves are... How do I say it? They're pretty good. That's all you gotta know. So the light version, down forward light punch. So, remember I told you about the running attacks? If you press four, if, if you... If you double tap forward twice, and then hold the last button, you can actually run. Like, Not yet. and I I like to use the heavy version, which is this one, the the, the running heavy punch, because it's the only one that can actually uh, special cancel to supers or decimations, and ex moves. So, it's pretty good. Or you got special cancel to any other moves that you wish. However, keep this in mind. For some reason, 
if you do it too early, you get this. Let's see. Like, for some reason, whenever you input the quarter circle forward, like, punch, and then press forward, it's considered double tapping. So... Notice how I I only press one button to double tap four. So keep him keep that in mind. It all depends on the position. If you're pretty far, then yeah, it's gonna be easy to to cancel to running attacks. Or just running itself. Or you could just use it just to run away. Or do a cross up. Let's see. It is possible, but you gotta be real quick about it. Oh well. Anyways, that's just the light version. Now the heavy version is does a does a juggle too. Actually, both attack, both special moves does a juggle, but this one does a knockdown. And you could catch the opponent like that too. Let's see. Like I said, all the all the running attacks are are juggles except the the light kick. Running light kick. Let's see. See what I mean? That was a reset. All right. Now we got that out of the way. I recommend you using it while you're launching your opponent like this. Keep in mind the inputs is pretty awkward. So yeah. All right, next, we're going to focus on... The next move is... Oh, yeah, I really did this one already. So this one is the jump one. So neutral or four jump, you get this. And it's a good way to punish your opponent if you try to throw a projectile. You can just wham. You could combo. Depends on which one. Like that Not one, yet. if you if you time it right, you can press down heavy to lock him up. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Let's try let's try the light kick version. Oh dear. How how bad of an angle do I have to do it? Not <laughs> yet. Let's see. But yeah, you could just use this move to cancel your opponents. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Damn. Okay. Man, that move sucks. <laughs> Alright, next is the... Okay, you already know the EX. You know what? Might as well. So, while you're in the air, you can press forward EX or back EX. Like, bam. And then, same thing with this one. They're, they're basically the same, it's just the, the, the quarter circle forward EX is, uh... It, it helps you down real quick. And you got plenty of time to launch the opponent, like, just to juggle. I don't know which move that's faster, but... Yeah. And then the back one, you know, slows you down a little bit. Good cross up too. All right. Next is the okay. Now you guys are gonna have a fun time. Quarter circle forward, light kick. Now you got okay. You guys gotta learn this real good, because I ain't gonna teach you guys once. If you do the heavy version and you're up close, you can actually input some attack, like down heavy punch. Let's find out. Down heavy punch and then run running heavy punch afterwards. Or you could do this. Depends. Let's do it again. And you can also cancel it, which we're gonna get to that one that that EX move I've been using constantly. Now that's the heavy version. Now if you do the light version. Here's the thing, it, for some reason, if you do the heavy version and you decide to not like juggle the opponent and decide to input the light version, 
which is this one. I recommend you using quarter circle forward light punch. And also make sure you get the bow cancel right. Let's see. No. Oh, you, you get the idea. You just gotta do that. And if you input the light, the light punch, uh, the light version, yeah, just do this automatically. But if you input the the light version, then the heavy version, you're gonna have a hard time comboing things. Use unless unless you have a reason to do it, and that's only if you do it in the corner. Now you're gonna have a hard fun time in the corner. It's like endless juggles. You, you get the idea. You're just doing a lot of juggles in the corner. That's the only reason you do the light version, then the heavy version. But if you put the heavy version, then the light version, that's when you have to quarter circle for light punch. And input whatever juggle to continue the combo. Anyways, that's pretty much the... Yeah, just experiment on it. Just go crazy. Go to the lab on it and, you know, see what's up. Okay, next we're going to focus on the... Yikes. Okay, quarter circle back light punch and quarter circle back heavy punch is a parry. And it could go through, it could parry projectiles, um, heavy, like, it could, it pretty much everything, dude. Everything. So the light punch doesn't do nothing. It just goes through, through whatever projectile or attack against the opponent. So... You know, it just goes through. Now, now we're gonna focus on the heavy punch. Now, the heavy version, quarter circle back, heavy punch. If you press uh, light punch, it does. It's just the. It's just that one special move I've been doing in the air, which we're gonna get to that real quick. Stop that. And then, okay, you know how neutral jump looks like. So the light, the light kick version or heavy kick, whenever you neutral, whenever you do the quarter circle back heavy punch, if you press light kick, I recommend you using it if the opponent is running towards you, because it only hits the back attacks. You see what I mean? Go ahead. Notice it hits the back attacks. I recommend you using it if the opponent is running towards you. Because, you know, you could... I don't know. Yeah, but... Yeah, just do it when the opponent is running towards you. Now that we got out of the way... I think that's all the... Oh, we're missing two more. So... Now, down, down, light kick. It goes through projectiles and goes forward. What the hell? My bad, it goes back. My apologies. You know, it's like one of them keep-aways, you know? Now, down-down heavy punch. Down-down heavy kick, I meant. Actually goes through projectiles. Same thing with the other one. But this time it goes forward. And it goes through two. It's pretty confusing, but you're gonna have so much fun with it. And you could cancel it to attacks if your opponent's juggling. You could just do this. Let's see. Not yet. That's if you don't want to waste your, your EX meter. Not or something yet. like that. And then last but not least, quarter circle four uh, throw. Now, dude, you're gonna have a fun time. Now, uh, a command throw is the most broken thing you can have in the game. So, I can't... Hold on, let me see if I could pick player two on this one. Give me a sec. I gotta get the other controller. Yeah. 
We gotta find out starting with the time. Alright, you notice that dude four attacks, right? That does three, so you can combo with your throws. And keep in mind, if you're being combo and, and the opponent decides to throw you, you could throw break. But the opponent cannot throw break this. You, they can't do nothing on it. Whoops. That's why the. That's why the command throws are the most broken thing in the game, because you can actually combo with it too. You see what I mean? Um, you, you pretty much get you get yourself a free combo, you know. And you could just put quarter circle four hippie punch, down like kick. You, you get the idea. Let's try again. You know, all the combos you could think of. Alright, now, finally, we're gonna focus on the EX moves. Okay. Okay, you pretty much know the airs, right? Okay, remember I told you about why why most of your running attacks should be EX cancelled? So you can you can't EX cancel this attack. But not the not the last hit. See it requires both cancel. But during your during your opponent during your character jabbing the opponent You can actually you can actually EX cancel. Now quarter circle four EX cancel is the most broken thing you ever want. And same thing, you could pretty much like You see you, you just see what happened, right? It's a guard break, dude. You could literally guard break your opponent. You know, you could just pr pretty much do any crazy moves with it. That's that's all you gotta know, dude. Like, if you have one, if you have one bar of um, a decimation meter, just go, just go nuts, dude. Like, dude, that's a lot of damage just by using two fortune meters, uh, two supers. And trust me, you could do crazy stuff. This is just me trying to make it simple for y'all. Because, man, it, it's, it's pretty hard to do some crazy ones. Now, then there's the the Down Down EX. Now, Down Down EX is pretty cool. Um, it cancels real quick. Like, like, you could do some crazy things you could think of. Let me see if I got this. Bam, 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 bam. Oh my gosh, it's pretty hard. Oh, I can't even input, dude. I'm so sweaty. That's crazy. Huh. Oh well. But yeah, you could do some crazy combos while you're in the air just by using EX meter. And not only that, you only waste half of your meter on it, like half of the meter of the bar. There it is. And then you can use one of your, um, whatchamacallit, one of your fortune meter to continue on doing it. You know, stuff like that. Oh, but keep in mind, if you try to combo, if you if you use one of your bold if you use one of your fortune meter to bold cancel, the damage will be reduced dramatically. For her, I don't know why, but this chick, her damage reduced real real bad, dude. But as long as you have like the supers or your or level one decimation, the damage will not be capped for that. 
I think that's all of them, right? Let's see what we're missing. Oh, quarter circle back uh, EX, which is the parry. Um, just look at this in. Oh crap! I didn't parry on time. You know that 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 parry gives you a free a free combo, you know? Or pretty much you could do whatever you want with it. Keep in mind, I don't know why, but sometimes it depends on certain characters, but that EX move is not safe. And that shit pisses me off, right? Sorry about my language, but just letting you know. That EX is pretty good, but it it has some good distance, keep in mind. Other than that, just you know, have fun with it. Um, supers, down forward, down forward, no, no, down back, down back, punch, or down back, down back, heavy punch, doesn't matter. It gives you this one, the one I've been doing. If you manage to do it up close, you get yourself some free juggle. You get the idea. Um, I recommend using it on the, on the corner, or if you manage to get this, like here, that works. That's only in the corner though. This too. Again, corner. And Oh, and also this one here. Whenever you do the running hit punch. Not yet. Let's see. And then quarter circle, double quarter circle forward, um, down forward, down forward, heavy punch or light punch. It gives you the super. And it has some good distance, I'll say right here. Now, you could also do it while, while you're juggling your opponent. Be careful, it's pretty dangerous. Like you can do it right here and then catch him like that. Bam. But, but, do not do it while, let's say, do not do this one here. It, it's gonna go over them. Now, usually, what I recommend you doing is this move. That's right, you gotta do that one. Oh, I forgot to mention. You gotta wait too. <laughs> and then you catch them all. And last but not least, let's focus on the the retreat. Now, if you hold EX and then press uh, back dash twice. I'm, the only reason I'm letting you guys know is this move is pretty bad. You actually, if you're blocking and then you do this, you will take some hits, by the way. Let's see. Come on, dummy. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Damn, this guy just did the whole combo. So, so the the bow counter has some bad recovery, but, but, um, it depends, dude. It depends. You could you you can't take some damage while you're in in the middle of it. But the good thing about it is that you could do this, but it has some bad distance. If the opponent is chasing you, and he and the only thing he wants is just to get you from uh. Very close distance because he's a type of opponent that does not have projectiles. Yeah, do this to punish him. Other than that, that's that's I pretty much taught you everything you got to know about Zacky Elf. Um, it it all it's all about the timing. I don't like using the down four heavy. 
down for heavy punch. It's kind of tricky for me, so I'm pretty much used to the light version. Not yet. And yeah, it's all about spacing with this chick. If you know your distance and you know which one you gotta, which move you gotta input. Not yet. And yeah. If you're in a corner, just go crazy, dude. Oof, I missed. Let's see. I did the I did the heavy version. Oof. Yeah, it's all about the spacing, and you could pretty much death combo if you have your your full bar of uh, decimation, and also a full bar of uh, sigil, and a full bar of uh, fortune meter. You can do some crazy stuff. Thanks for watching. I'm just gonna try to. I, 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 that's it. That's it. I pretty much taught you everything about Zacky Elf. And yeah, I'm just gonna like try to do this combo. And then end the stream like that. Ooh. Very tricky. Oh my goodness. Not yet. Oh, I pretty much gave up. I'm just gonna waste all my bar meat on this. Let's see. Let's see if we got this. Yeah, uh, I try to do any cool combos. I mean, I could probably teach you some bless modes, but bless mode is pretty much copy and paste. The only difference is that you could you could still do some crazy ones, or you could just pretty much spam the same move you want. You know, spam, cancel it. Yeah, that, that's all you gotta do. What else? It's... You know, you get the idea. That's pretty much blessed mode. And yeah, have a good day. That's it. I, I pretty much did everything I can. I hope this video is helpful. Hope if it's not. Sorry that I wasted your time, have a wonderful day, and see you guys next time.